All right, everybody, Baron here, and welcome back to Totally Aggro Battle Simulator. Now, look at this. This is build 0.8.6. Anyway, in the last video, we did a lot of uh, challenges. You guys left some comments. People voted for them, aka liked them, and we have some incredible ones today. So, what I'm thinking is I want to alternate, right? Challenges and custom battles. If you have an original idea, leave it below, and people will be like, Oh my god, that's amazing. We've never seen that before. I'm voting for it. But leave your custom battle suggestions below. And what I want you to do is think about upcoming movies and custom battles from those. So we're going to be going into the campaigns here. And look at this. I have $1,800 and we're fighting an army of skeletons, correct? Yes. All right. So the deal is, you see this little guy? He's a hobbit. 610 here was saying that we have to defend the hobbit. Have a hobbit in every battle, and if it dies, you lose. Even if we've won the battle. We can't win the battle if the hobbit dies. It's just those are the rules. The hobbit needs to be alive at the end. And if he, does, if he dies, we have to restart. So, this is no easy task. All right, so then naturally I think I want to put my hobbit at the back. And remember that these guys are really good at scaring us off of cliffs. Well, my strategy here for the first one entirely depends on this brave man, the ninja and his shuriken throwing abilities. I don't know if he's going to be able to hit these skeletons or if their shields are going to, you know, stop them. But I'm hoping he did- oh my god, he's crushing them until he hit the bomb of my own units. Why are there bombs exploding behind my lines? Why are there bombs? Oh, that's a- that's a head. Okay, those- are the, those aren't bombs. Those are actually the enemy's heads. Which indicate- No! What are you doing up there? Oh my god, please- he's alive! He's alive! This battle needs to end because he- Oh, okay. There you go. We're pausing the battle. How close did we get? There's literally one guy, I think, with his femur- uh, There's a few guys left. Alright, these bomb guys sucked. They did me nothing good. Maybe what we could do... What if we put two bards over on these sides and we've got $410 left? I'm not doing any bomb throwers. Well, remember in the last video, we did an animals only challenge and you know what? That actually worked out pretty well. So maybe we need to recruit some animals. Oh yeah, I still have the bards that literally do almost nothing and there's someone's rib cage is spinning around like a disco top. I don't know what a disco top is. Oh, no. Oh, no, sir. You have a duty to protect the president. You can't just run and die. Well, we... <laughs> He's taunting us. He knows if he dies, we have to restart. Okay. But once again, he, he's getting scared. We've got some frost arrows, but nothing that's going to take this out. Hold on a second. If our hobbit is the president of the United States of America, he's got good intelligence agencies. And his agency say, if the enemy is made of bones, all we need is bone mages, right? Is, is that how intelligence agencies work? So we're gonna be throwing spears, we're gonna be sending bones from- Come on! Sons of gods, you gotta do it! They're running. Wait, they're running backwards. This could work. This could still work. Where's our hobbit? Oh god. Where is he? Is he- Oh, he's, he's running. Okay, he's running and I don't know what he's doing to that man, but uh- <laughs> Yeah! All right, so we recruited the CIA and they've got some dark magic. The president and his secret service have been ambushed. And it looks like there's like Pepsi Cola commercials going on here, man. All right, I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but the hobbit's in the middle. And the idea is the bone mages are gonna destroy a lot of the incoming army right away. They were supposed to do it a little bit earlier. Oh my goodness! It's like fireworks, but the fireworks are bones and they are enemies. Hold on. I swear to goodness, if this is a hobbit, okay. But I need to find where the president is. There he is! Okay, he's still alive. He's in a burning pile of uh, hay bale army men, soldiers, guys. Now we have to go and fight archers. I don't think this is gonna work out too well for us. The president is on fire. This is not working out for us. <laughs> and there, he's dead. Maybe the way to do it is uh, not do a themed challenge, but instead go to challenge. All right, this is a good one. $3,900. 3850 to protect the president. This is the boar formation. Okay. Shields and jumping guys with axes. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. 
in theory. You know who we're gonna recruit? The Reaper. And you know what, I'm gonna put him up here. You know what, it, it, I just actually wanna see. And let's put a few musketeers back here. All right, what happens when a bunch of berserkers leap at a deity of the undead? Oh, I think some musketmen, oh, <laughs> he just snatched one of them out of the air, boys. That was good. Oh, 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 okay. Somebody please, no! How? How did you get our, you stop? Ah! We're fighting berserkers. They're gonna go berserk and jump over him. So the safest place is actually not on the front lines either. I mean, it doesn't, the Secret Service always has like one sniper, right? So look at this guy. I wish we could have like a modern faction and we could be doing this like with a president unit. You know what, that would be great for tabs, wouldn't it? Okay, okay, please protect this guy. If you could create little mini games where you could actually have like the rules coded in. So it's like a sandbox, but it's a sandbox for games. Game modes, right? Hey! All right, we did it properly. We just moved him over to the side. We had a decoy party led by this guy. Is this, you got something in the cave there, huh? Huh? Yeah. Yeah, you do, don't you? Please tell me there's nothing else. We had- this is where the raptor, the raptor rider secret unit was, wasn't it? Well, he's gonna be running at these guys full tilt. You know what? I like this idea where he gets an honor guard, although I'm gonna need to make him cheaper. They're gonna have- this is, uh, honor guard on a budget. We're gonna put two guys with clubs instead of, you know, guys with guns. But we do have a couple guns, and I'm kind of relying on this guy. Yeah, to- to hopefully- Oh, okay, they've got a lot of health, so he's dead, and this idea has failed already. And there's my president, trying to headbutt <laughs> the elite soldiers. <laughs> Strategy time. This guy, known as a berserker, jumps into these guys. This man, who's super smart and won't totally mess up this plan, sees all of them congregating around him and chucks a bomb. And he chucks a bomb, and does it blow them up? Oh, it kind of did. I mean, he's, he's, he's still alive. That guy's got a very small head, doesn't he? It's like voodoo, man. We need a voodoo faction. All right, bomb guy, please don't mess this up. The president is right here. He wants to fight. He's a big fighter, this guy. Okay. Well, wait a minute. He's still alive? He won't be very long. He's, where'd he go? <laughs> No. All right, so we prepare, uh, we basically replace the budget secret service with the uh, water dancer. Isn't that what they call the, the water dancer? What was that Game of Thrones thing? All right, muskets are okay. Bombs should be better. Please, where's the? I normally the president's like right here. Here he is, following our 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 sword master. Guys, you're gonna need to start shooting, cause when that bone mage gets here. It's gonna be bad. Fire! Oh my god, it worked! You guys gotta fire faster! And I can't do anything to protect him, so... You yeah, don't, don't, don't club our president! He's still alive! He is alive! I know he's alive! Someone shoot the bullet! Oh, You, you... You just had to, you just had to do it. <laughs> he tried to smack him in the face, and it didn't work. You know the hobbits. <laughs> Look, he's like, hey guys, what's up? <laughs> oh my god. Is he alive? He is alive. <laughs> well, he's not going to be alive for very long. You know, because uh, these guys got clubs and shields, and, and they just don't like you. Oh. All right, I got it. I don't know. Uh, let's just have guys that shoot swords really fast and accurately. And a couple of them. Please don't die. Oh god, they're totally gonna die. They are going to die. Oh, oh my god, that was just like... that. I, I thought we were screwed. I thought this plan was doomed. Now those guys have shields, so that's... that's... we're doomed. We are still doomed. And the president's out there. I'm just gonna have to see... We... hold on. We, we technically achieved victory on this one, but... <laughs> Do you see these furry feet? Is he taking a nap? Is he buried? How is the president gonna survive against the Greek armies? Look at this! It's a freaking phalanx! Wait a minute, they have no range. Oh, okay, so if we put like a few bone mages out? We have like almost no money at all. So I'm hoping this guy will attract them and bunch them up and the bone mage can do something about it. And then we got archers, so... It's Bone Mage- Hey! No, 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 Bone Mage, hold on. I- I'm technically a part of this. 
Okay, we, we did it. We did it. Where's our- Oh, president. What? Hey, these guys have shields. He, he has a chance. There's a, there's some sharp sticks incoming. And he's dead. Wait a minute. A bunch of bomb throwers. One, two, three, four. We have- we have the perfect amount of money. Okay. The berserker has to do enough, and these guys' bombs have to be perfect. Okay, they're all attracted. Did we get the timing down? No, we didn't get the timing down. Okay, all we gotta do is get the timing down. Pirates. Bomb throwers as close as possible. Maybe move the berserker back. Okay. Okay, okay, it's gonna work. I believe that we will win. And if we chant it enough, okay, the bombs went out first. Okay, the berserker's still alive, somehow. He's not anymore, he's dead now. You guys, you guys, you know the drill. Protect the president, he's coming, he's angry, he wants to fight some people. Oh god. <laughs> oh yes. Oh, he couldn't even get close enough this time. You see that? It's almost like he's on our team, but he's not. This challenge is absurd. Oh my gosh. This guy, see, this is why I love your guys' ideas. They're just brilliant. Okay, rule number one, distract the enemy. Rule number two, pop the president. And then after that, it's like, I don't know, man. We gotta put enough guys out there. All right, let's see how this works. We got painters, which hopefully, <laughs> what happened to my voice? <laughs> will hopefully dodge these incoming magical potions, right? Because they can dodge stuff. I guess this guy, you have the unenviable task of fighting three guys that should be able to beat you one on one, but, oh. Oh yeah, I forgot, okay, they're, they're, well, that, that happened, hurry, hurry, shoot them, oh no, oh no, this, this is already, this is, this is, he's alive, he's alive, and this guy can't hit him, this is, no, please, what happened, is he, are you trying to bury him with your feet, is he, is he sleeping, I don't think he's sleeping, I need, I need confirmation, uh, yeah, the president's down. Eagle one is down. Eagle one is down. I swear, it's the animal challenge inspiration from the last video. Use animals! Use them well! Distract the enemy, please do not- If he walks off this cliff- Oh my gosh. Our- our likelihood of failure. Wait a minute. This isn't good. This guy's got a giant blade. And that's a bomb. <laughs> Our president is dead. <laughs> You see this, man? These are our chances. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think it's gonna work. But we put two Valkyries in the air. Where- Where are you going? Oh! Okay, that's actually okay. Wait, are they dying? Are they flying? Are they dying flying? <laughs> yes! <laughs> okay, the president's alive! And he actually has a chance because the Valkyries out here and balloon guys are doing their job. Wait a minute, no! No, Mr. President! <laughs> Watch out for the fart juice bottles! Hey, please don't get- The poison gas is bad. He's taking a nap. Oh my god. He is just taking a nap. And he's still alive. Until... Until he's not. Alright, we're gonna have to put him back even further, I guess? Because that was a viable strategy. Berserkers are a hobbit's best friend, right? They jump over, distract everybody. Are they- No, 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 you guys- he, Please, please, kill a few of them. He, he's missing because he's so drunk. He's, he's got too much green gas. The gas attacks. Oh. Yes! Hit them! Wait! 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 Wait a minute! Yes! Okay, 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 there's a chance. Not a very good one, but there is a chance. Okay. Oh, no, 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 Mr. President. Don't- Don't do it! Don't do it! He did it. Hold on. If he is still alive, if somehow we're victorious before he flies out... <laughs> I don't think... <laughs> Mr. President! <laughs> Wait, is he stuck? If there's no proof of death, he's alive. <laughs> Wait a minute. He's... He's stuck. Guys, he didn't fly out. He... I don't know. He's alive as far as I'm concerned. And then, <laughs> wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> there he is! He's holding him down, I think. <laughs> What is happening? Hey, it's a victory in the president's holding that body, which is why he's through the map. <laughs> I swear, right? I don't know. 
Okay, there's like nothing that costs 60 bucks other than a bard, right? Well, a bard is what we're gonna get then. The president's in the back. We've got a couple of these guys. Oh, we got archers and a bomb thrower. Dang it. Bomb thrower didn't work out too well. That's a lot of dudes coming, guys. Maybe, I don't know, shoot some arrows. Fire some bomb thingies. Protect the freaking president. He's out there. Is he dead yet? Yeah, he did. I honestly don't know. This is the hardest challenge I've ever come across. Okay, now we're gonna go to Pixel Droppers Challenge, and it is only women units. This one almost got a thousand votes from the video two days ago. The Defend the Hobbit one got 864, so this is the most voted for one. So the female only units are, is the Harvester a female? Guys, I think the Harvest, that's a female. She got braids. Okay, the harvester's a female. All right, so here are all the female units that I found. The farmer faction has the harvester. We got the headbutter and the Valkyrie from the Viking faction. We've got the pirate queen, Taekwondo, Lady Red Jade, and Artemis. So we've got some pretty powerful units. There's seven that I found. I may have missed one. If I did, let me know in the comments, but $12,510, a lot of really beefy, strong hero units. So, we're gonna follow up on that mission that we, the president just couldn't beat. Now we have less units, but we don't have any, we don't need any of them to survive so long as we win. So I guess we need somebody to survive, but it doesn't have to be the president. I feel better about that. I'm gonna use Taekwondo guys, and I'm just gonna kick the poops out of these guys. Oh, I can only afford four. Ooh, we're low on money. Lady Red Jade's too expensive. Maybe the way to do it is to do harvesters. All right, this is all we could feel because we're limited on this mission, this challenging map, by the amount of gold we have. So we could only field three units, but I'm hoping the harvesters can clean house, which isn't happening. You know what? We're skipping this one, and this one's called Arrow. Okay, and I've got 2,500 bucks. You know what? We're just gonna put our best challenger out there, the Pirate Queen. And this was probably a bad idea because who we're up against is units that do heavy damage and there's a lot of them. So I'm hoping she just drops the bomb, cleans house. She's got a lot of health. Nope. Oh. See, this is the thing about your challenges. Some of you guys have some amazing ones and they are so freaking hard. A line of head butters followed by Taekwondo. We mean to kick these guys out of the place and hopefully the head butters do their best at distracting the enemy. All right, Taekwondos, do your thing. Kick, 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 kick. Oh, okay, we're defeated. This is proving, now remember, these are the most challenging ones. Well, can Lady Red Jade do it? Normally you just like put lots of range units. I don't think there's any female range units in the game that I can find. Ah, oh. but you know what? I'm pretty sure we can deal with this one. More wheelbarrows, fine, not a problem. Still don't have enough to purchase Artemis here. I'm going Pirate Queen and Lady Red Jade. Isn't Lady Red Jade supposed to be one of like the best units in the game? Oh, we do have potion. We do have potion throwers. It's so weird when I hear one of the units that has like my voice talking in the game. It's hilarious. Okay, Lady Red Jade is like turning herself into a tornado before. I've never really like used her much like in terms of like custom battles or even in just like beating some of the campaigns. Okay, there we go, there we go, we're in the enemy line. Yes, okay, so Lady Red Jade and the Pirate Queen here on this women unit only challenge seems to be working out very well. I feel like if we're up against battles where we have to fight a lot of people, a la here, oh, and a Zeus? Ugh, maybe I spoke too soon. Wait a minute, I know how we can do this. We need them to fly and hopefully one of them will snipe. Wow, I'm using exactly the right amount of money. We're using an all Viking force? I don't know. The, the biggest challenge, I think we could have easily dealt with that, but Zeus is a game changer. Maybe we should put the Pirate Queen in there? And uh, see, one of these Valkyries has to kill Zeus. Otherwise, there's just no chance of this winning. Hold on, are you alive? No, you got smited by the deities above. And so did our battle plan. So we're gonna have to scrap that completely. And we're gonna have to rely on the Pirate Queen. I still want some Valkyries. All right, the Pirate Queen's just gonna have to take lightning bolts to the face and live. That's our strategy. Survive. Lightning bolts, lightning bolts. The Valkyries don't do their, don't do the job. Oh, wow. The Pirate Queen has to be one of the best units in the game. 
We don't really know if the race is a male or a female. We have like some gender neutral ones. Oh my god, please survive! Yes! Stab him! Get him! Kill Zeus! Throw the bombs and go! <laughs> Look at him fire lightning bolt straight up. Come on and hit him! Yes! Yes! Oh, well... <laughs> Now we know how Zeus died. <laughs> Alright, we'll try this one once again. Once more into the breach. Alright, Pirate Queen. This is like the Wedge Antilles formation. We got- we got just this weird shield wedge. Pirate Queen, you gotta- you gotta drop your bombs and go. Oh, did it? No, it didn't kill the Valkyries though. She's getting absolutely wrecked from all sides. We got- we got axe throwers. The Valkyries flying in with their little swords, but the bombs! Can the bombs hit some of the Valkyries? Yes! No! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Who was it? The- the girls are betraying, man! Alright, I mean, this is the one we tried to protect the president on and realized this was like a really, really bad one. I don't think the pirate- no, the pirate queen does get scared. Oh my gosh. She dropped her bombs and she just did some triple car wheels and looked like she was about to fly off the map. I don't think there's any skelly warlords yet. So she should be able to endure this pain of the flames. We got a Valkyrie back there who's actually still alive somehow. Okay, yeah, Pirate Queen, I don't I don't think you're gonna be able to do this, man. There's, uh, or lady, there's, there's just too many fire arrows coming in your way. And once you get hit once by one of these guys, you're gonna get scared, aren't you? Oh, she dropped the bombs! And she avoided the incoming hits! And the bones are flying everywhere! And she's dodging stuff like she's Neo from the Matrix! Okay! We got a chance here! Yes! Well... Come on. You, you just got- you got one more. Do your flips, and... Boom! <gasps> Alright, so... The women only challenge was pretty freaking tough. Not as tough as protect the VIP president. You guys are just straight savages. This is the army that I have to beat. We've got a samurai giant, we've got five senseis, we've got, I think there's 20 clubbers, two reapers, 10 musketeers, two bomb cannons, and three frost giants. For a whopping total of 47,900 gold, or dollars, or currency, whatever it is. And I have to beat this with $10,000? And I can't control my units? <laughs> what is it? What? The what? The what? Well, this this is my attempt, and apparently I just spawned in a giant Chuko Nu. So that's kind of cool. I've got ballistas and Chuko Nu, and then just a ton of bards, and we also had enough money to throw in one spear thrower. So whoops, let's do it. Nine thousand nine hundred forty. Now, if I can beat this, that's just magical. Uh, I don't know how we're supposed to defeat these reapers. I'm hoping that the bards. Why are you running at them? You're supposed to be running away, aren't you? This is not good. Okay, the ballistas took out one of my guys. We've got Chuko News firing all over the place. Maybe I just need all Chuko News. Maybe that's the best chance I have. Because their musketeers are taking me down, and ballistas don't seem to be doing enough damage <laughs> on the giants. I, uh, wait, one of the reapers actually died. I think he may have taken a ballista bolt. They have exploding cannons and range. So you guys are- I'm gonna give this one more go with just all Chuko news, I think, or maybe all muskets. Alright, now you get 47,000. So, I'll do 35,000. Alright, 34,980, let's start it. So basically, I went in a crescent formation. We've got a lot of damage dealers that specify in range, and a few units that specialize in charging the enemy. Now, I realize they have the Reaper, but the idea here is if I can take out some of those cannons or even distract these units long enough, hopefully what's gonna be happening- Do we have a giant down already? No, we do not. Oh wait, what are the giants is? Okay, the Samurai Giant is down. Down. We do have cannons. Someone's throwing bombs. That's their cannon bomb thrower. I guess we've got some artillery cannons of my own. The Chuko New Line has basically crumbled, and right behind it is the Musketeers. Did we put them too far up? It really depends if these ballistas can take out the enemy. Okay, all three Frost Giants are up. That's the problem. The, the explosives are still going. We still got ballistas, and we actually have a few units that are over here. Oh, they've got a few units over here, too. So the Chuko Nu- Oh, man! 
You gotta finish that guy off for us. Wait a minute. I was thinking those giants would survive long enough. Okay. So there we go. We used the formation. And you know what? Thank you, no copyright songs. Thank you for everybody who left a comment. Leave one below. This time, they're custom battles for the next tabs video. Put them in the comments below. If you see one you like, give it an upvote. And the most voted for ones. And then, you know what? Also, just to make sure that we also see some of some really cool ones and give everybody a chance, I'm going to start choosing, like, one or two, kind of like, you know, my choice. So even if they don't have a ton of votes, right? But we'll definitely choose the ones that have a ton of votes. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.